So many of you have asked, how can you start off in the film industry? And today I am joined by my good buddy, Scott Bell. And Scott is a sound recordist as well as a cameraman. And he's gonna to talk to you today about some tips and tricks and how you can get yourself started on a new career possibly in film. So let's roll. So welcome back everybody. My name is Steven of Steven and Janica and Many of you guys have often asked how you can start in this film industry and I thought it might be great to bring Scott aboard and have him answer some questions on what his experience has been in this industry. So five ideas, rapid thoughts on how you can get yourself ahead. Let's go. Hey Steven, so thanks for bringing me out today. Uh, film business is great. Lots of rewards, lots of demands too. It's an intense business. Uh, it demands that you be a good listener on set. It's always a ball to follow and it's mouth closed, ears open. That would be my first tip. Be a good listener. Realize that you're there to make a difference and that you can only do that by collecting information about what the process is. You want to watch that producer director. Oftentimes a shot will get discussed before it happens. That's the key time to be listening. If you want to get into the business, volunteer. Call it the Canadian Film Center here in Toronto, Canada or anywhere that production happens. Show up and say, I'd like to learn the business. I got a good head on my shoulders and I'm willing to give my time. No production doesn't want someone that's willing to volunteer time, as long as you, uh, you're a good listener. So here's a fundamental tip, and one I often overthink, but uh, Scott's got an idea here. So you always want to dress for the conditions and bring more than you think you need. Uh, you can get into midnight, 1 a.m. shooting, and the temperature drops, folks. You want extra layers. Extra layers, <laughs> yep. Learned that the hard way. <laughs> So, so far our notes have all been about you personally, but you want to prepare your equipment would be my fourth tip. And when I say prepare, I mean the day before, test everything out. Know what your battery so levels are at. True. Have everything ready to go. You want to be like a coiled spring ready to go off when you show up on set. You don't want to be building your kit for a half hour while everyone stands around and watches you happen. I see a lot of junior people doing that, unfortunately. Uh, and. It's understandable, you know, there's the time mandated for the task, but think of it this way. If you can save production five minutes, that's one more shot they get out of the day, and they'll remember that about you. That is some good advice. Uh, you should start a vlog. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, rolling out number five. Tip number five would be, understand that your role as a technician, DP, whatever role you choose, make sure you enjoy the craft of that role. That's what you're gonna to wanna to depend on on tough days when you're working in the rain or it's midnight or there's some difficult personalities to manage on set. These things all happen. You gotta stay cool and calm and remember what you're there to do, which is execute the craft that you have a passion for. Enjoy it. So there you guys go. That's five fundamentally important tips if you're looking to get involved in the film industry. This is my buddy Scott Bell. As I mentioned before, I'm gonna drop his information below so you can check out his amazing work. And until next time, please hit that like and subscribe button and let us know your thoughts on tips and tricks and how you would get involved in the film industry and your ideas for what you do and what you need to be prepared on set. Oh, so, tip number six is be more like Steven. No, no, just, <laughs> just do you. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> we will catch you later and thanks again.